The ideal is really going to a grocery store, getting the ingredients, making a meal from scratch. But the realistic answer is that I use services like Uber Eats. I've even done meal prep plans as well. Because I'm a conflicted person and I don't just live one certain way, it really depends. I eat healthy during the week, I eat really a lot of dairy and a lot of meat during the weekends and it's, you know, so I think it, it really depends on what day of the week you get me on. I think it would be my wet mac and cheese because it has a little bit of goat cheese and it makes it nice and sharp. And I put in peas because I love peas. I think they're the best vegetable ever. Yeah, I say like a big vat of mac and cheese is what makes me happiest. <laughs> I was about to make a joke about sports because I know nothing about sports except if it's uh, tennis. Um, I would say definitely a concert. And what I love about concerts is that it's the only thing that I can actually do by myself because I'm not good at being alone. But I love going to a concert and just kind of getting lost. I know that some people are very intimidated by cooking and so I'm not very particular about what the method or like what venue they use as long as they are cooking. And if you use kind of like a meal box or like a, 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 a prep sort of situation where you get the ingredients sent and everything is sort of already kind of like divided up and like labeled and everything, then I'm fine with that because you're still at least creating something from nothing. It's about progress, not perfection. That's how I feel. Which is pretty good life advice too. You know the tip about never go to a grocery store hungry? That's literally what I do 99.99999% of the time. And I think some awesome discoveries are made in those instances. I, I do like dining out a lot. I was, uh, I was a waiter and a busboy and a manager and a sommelier for like 10 years. And so I really love going to a restaurant and kind of looking at how everything is sort of set up. I, I love looking where bussers sort of operate and if like, are they cutting the bread next to the espresso station? Cause that's how I was used to doing it. I love just kind of looking at like the, the lay of the land in a restaurant. And it's nice to have that experience and the lighting and the music and all of that. You know what, it's kind of like on Queer Eye where we kind of meet people where they're at. And I feel like that's what the card does so well is that it's very open to like different ways of life.